Hi, Christopher. It's Sister Emily, and we're going to do your Sunday school lesson real quick. So, this is from Matthew chapter 8, verse 23, and it's about Jesus calming the storm. It says, Then Jesus got into the boat and started across the lake with his disciples. Suddenly, a fierce storm struck the lake with waves breaking into the boat, but Jesus was sleeping. The disciples went and woke him up. Shouting, Lord, save us, we're going to drown. Jesus responded, Why are you afraid? You have so little faith. Then he got up and rebuked the wind and the waves, and suddenly there was a great calm. The disciples were amazed. Who is this man? they asked. Even the winds and the waves obey him. So I got a, put a little project together for you, a little craft. And so what you're going to do is you're going to take your blue water here. Okay, and we're going to make a boat, and that's going to be Jesus and the disciples on the boat. So, you can put this down for right now. Grab your bottom of your boat, okay, and we're going to take one of the popsicle sticks, and we're going to tape it on the back side, okay? So, tape it however you want to tape it on there. So there's the bottom of your boat, okay, and then we're going to take your sail on your boat and we're going to tape it on the back side as well. And you can put it either as far up as you want or as far down by the boat you want. I think I'm going to put mine about right there. So get another piece of tape and just put it on there the best that you can. I have to make mine smaller. Hold on. And just tape it on there. I'm trying not to have it show. And there's your boat. And then you take your other popsicle stick you have. And another piece of tape and put it down here on the bottom on top of your other one behind the boat that way we can move your boat so now you have a boat and you can hold on to it and then there's your water so you can move your boat along the water so, Jesus calms the storms in our life, Christopher, and he's the only one that can do that for us. So, just keep that in mind when you get scared or you're panicky or anything is going on in your life, you can always ask Jesus to calm the storm. So, hope you enjoyed it. Have fun. Bye.